Okay guys, so we're starting off today's video. Um, so it's the first day of bikini prep for 2023. Um, I'm actually very excited. Um, I slept okay last night, so I'm in an okay mood. Um, I've had my first meal of the day, which was two large eggs, uh, 100 gram of egg whites, a 50 gram of avocado, and one slice of white bread. Um, I'm going to try and keep this meal in for as long as I can, only because I really, really love this meal. I'm obsessed with avocado at the minute. I started having it towards the end of my bulk, so I wanted to try and keep that in for as long as I can, just because it's something that I enjoy. Plus, I do really, really enjoy my breakfast meals. Um, so, I'm just sat outside work right now. Um, I had a class this morning um, at 7am, and then... Um, I've just got one at half nine so I thought I'd just do a little video quickly now there are a few things that I want to like focus on this prep um, more so with my mindset than anything uh, so like I don't want to focus on food uh, before I don't know if I really spoke about it but before I used to get up early in the morning um, and I'd just sit in bed watching videos of food and um, I'd also go to bed really early um, to sit in bed watching videos of food so that Chris didn't see me um just because chris would tell me off um anyone who doesn't know who chris is chris is my amazing partner um so yeah i used to do that to avoid chris seeing me watch these videos um so yeah i don't want to be food focused in any of this prep um i want to kind of sway away from that um also i had a stash box that i would every time i'd go shopping i'd buy something that i was craving and i'd put it in this box well this box got filled up literally within like the first probably like week of prep um and i think it's just a really bad idea uh because otherwise i'm just sat there staring at this box and um, the box couldn't shut either because it was that full so i had to like turn it away so that i couldn't see it um i put it under some drawers so i couldn't see it but i knew it was there all the time I'm going to try to not focus on food or anything um yeah the plan is i'm gonna train around six days a week um train six days a week that means that i'm moving more which ultimately means maybe i can have a little bit more food we're gonna see um so me and chris are doing my prep between us this time um I say between us, Chris is doing all of my training. He's telling me my macros. And then I'm setting myself my own food. However, um, however, he will probably end up taking over the food bit as well, just because um, when I did my first meal plan for it, um, Chris wasn't very happy with it because I was picking silly options. Um, so yeah, so we're gonna see how it goes um but yeah right i'm gonna go into work and then i will see you later okay guys so meal two we've got 100 gram of veg and 150 of chicken um i've also got this red hot sauce um i know loads of people recommend it in prep um so yeah i'm gonna try it so i don't know if i'm gonna be any good with this hot sauce but i thought i'd give it a go um i do like spicy things but I feel like this is going to be like a whole nother level of spice. I remember me and Chris went away for our anniversary once. And we ended up going to Turtle Bay uh, one of the nights. And I had, I think it was like Jamaica goat curry. And I knew it was going to be spicy. But I didn't realise it was going to be that spicy. And I had to ask for glasses of milk. Because my mouth was literally on a fire. So yeah, wish me luck. Hey, hey. <laughs> I never know how to spell these videos. So I'm with Tegan. Tegan is a client of mine and a friend. So we're gonna train legs together. I'm on a completely new plan. Okay, so first thing that you're gonna see is our warm up, which is four lots of 25. Uh, we're doing a giant set, so we're doing the abductor, then the adductor, then the ham curl and then the quad extension. We did split it into two, so we did the abductor and adductor back to back, and then we went on to the leg extension and hand curl, just because it's a lot of machines to take up for, um, for like two people. So we thought it was best to just do that for this time. Um, I'll probably stick with that as well, splitting it up.
jungle, you know. Um, we're doing three sets all together. We're doing a set of eight, a set of 12, and then a set of 15 plus. Obviously, because it's like the first one for this week, uh, for this rotation, just trying to get baseline of what weights I want to start at, and then hopefully progress for a few weeks, and then obviously numbers will start coming down. leg press we moved on to seated hamstring curl we did three sets a set of eight a set of 12 and then a set of 15 So moving on to Dumbbell Bulgarian Split Squats, I make Tegan do these all the time in her PT sessions, hence why she loves me so much. Um, these were actually really hard, I've not done them for a while. Um, in the clip that I've shown here, I am very, very wobbly on this leg. So last one is seated calf freezes and for this we did 5 sets of 8 to 12. Okay so we've just finished a leg day, how was it? Hard. <laughs> hard. Is it harder than PT or? No. No. Oh. You're here. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, uh, but yeah, so that's done with the training. I might do a little bit more. I might do a few more videos throughout today, you know, and see how I feel because I'm quite tired. But yeah, finished a leg day with Ted. leg day with Tegan. Um, I went home, had my post-workout meal and then pretty much came straight to work. Um, I'm just waiting for my last client. Um, I had a client before, um, Brody, um, and then now I've just got Molly to finish off the evening. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to 
end of the first video here. Um, I've just finished with my PT clients for the evening. Um, and yeah, I've just got home. Um, I'm absolutely starving, but it's absolutely fine because it's only day one. Uh, so that's obviously expected. Um, so yeah, absolutely starving. I've got one more meal left, which is literally just dark chocolate and a protein shake. Um, so I'm gonna try and long it out probably until nine o'clock. Um, and then I'll probably go to bed anyway. Um, I've still got another litre left to drink, so that will fill me up slightly anyway. So yeah, today has been absolutely fine. Um, I'm really excited for this little prep journey. So yeah, thank you for watching.